Hello everyone and welcome back to A Link to the Past. Uh, last time we actually got the Master Sword. And like you see in the equipment, we got power 2 in, on the sword. We also got this mushroom. And we're, what we were supposed to do actually is uh, we're supposed to save Zelda. But I don't really want to do that yet. What I want to do is a little bit side questing and trying to get the, as many heart uh, pieces as possible and also want to give the magic mushroom to the old lady. So that is basically what we are gonna do in this episode so we can get the magic powder and all that because the magic powder, believe it or not, it can come in handy uh, because what it does is basically uh, make uh, some random stuff uh, it makes uh, some of the enemies transform and one of the most uh, note notable uh, Uh, what is most uh, notable is um, about that is basically oh I can't do it yet. Uh, let's see, we go out and in. Let's see. Oh, okay. Right, I um, have to leave the screen and then come back like that again. And there we go. Thank you very much. <clears throat> uh, yeah. Uh, basically what uh, this thing does is transforming uh, some of the enemies like you say. It's not very useful you probably think but some enemies it's actually get, uh, were, uh, useful against. Uh, for instance, those lightning or pink bubble, uh, as we're calling it themselves. I don't know why we're calling bubble because we don't look, res we don't resemble anything like a bubble. Uh, so that's very very confusing. Um, I think this is just a fairy fountain. Yeah, yeah, that that's what it was. Completely worthless. Uh, but yeah, if you use the uh, magic powder on the bubble, then we basically uh, then we basically turn into a fairy, and that's a very useful thing. I don't really know. Oh, wrong. Yes, that's the one. Yeah, this, this is a secret word you can get. Uh, basically, it's nothing really useful secret. It's just that you get chest. We already get some bombs. 300 rupees. And then bombs. And that's really all about it that's not a big uh, secret to be honest and then also of course I have to complete the dungeon or castle part again which really isn't a lot because it's just up here and yeah another thing with a mesosaur uh, if you get full life you will shoot out a beam which doesn't really not that do so much uh, damage, but it's cool that you can do off uh, long range uh, attack. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot this one. Oh, he's he, he died. He, he died. Too bad. Too bad. Uh, let me just... Wrong. 
Let me see. I know for a fact that there are other stuff that we could do. I don't remember though. We got a hard pieces. Really? I don't really know if there is anything else relevant that we can actually do for the moment. Uh, I f actually thought that there were much, much more uh, that we could do, but I guess that's not the case. So I, I, I think we just uh, do the castle part. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we, we just do the castle part. Oh, whoops. Well, at least we can check it here. I, f I know for a fact that there's, there's another thing we can do. Well, not now. But later on. Whoa. Later on, you're supposed to go into this tree here. And then you come out. What? Let me just check. Yeah, you get a, you get out there and then you get a heart piece. So we can't do anything at this part here. No, um, let's just go to the castle and uh, save Zelda. Defeat, uh, defeat the boss and all that. Uh, and there is really nothing else. Fuck off. Uh, really uh, else we can do I I thought uh, there were more but oh, wait what's what's this oh yeah we, well at least we could get that harpy so I mean cool cool we achieved something uh, besides just the main part of the uh, quest. Where the hell am I going? Right. Get off the map. Die! Yeah, the the bee, the magic beam doesn't do as much damage as uh, the normal the normal sword slash, but at least at least uh, it does some damage, and also you can attack from distance, which is makes it much more easier. Oh, get off! Uh, so yeah, back in the castle, and we're gonna tackle on. Uh, we're gonna completely go and save Zelda, but we're gonna take an al alternative route, as we're not uh, supposed to go down in the prison cell. Uh, we're supposed to go over here at the main top. Slash this away and enter this part. And this section of the castle, I'm gonna be honest, is actually much more difficult. Um, I will go so far to say actually much more difficult than some of the dungeons. Uh, because we have much more difficult uh, oops, enemies. These ones can get dangerous because we actually take some damage if you're not careful. And obviously I'm not careful because I get pretty heck in my way. But basically yeah this this, this uh, whole section is really not not too difficult but it can it, it, at least it's much more difficult than some of the dungeons we've done so far um, because we have much more tougher enemies I will I will at least think the enemies are tougher 
So anything, I would like to uh, basically say it's, it's completely unnecessary to light the torches because I mean you can pretty much find your uh, the way around anyway if you just use your eyes and all that, follow the path and then you can find your way around like this. Uh, but yeah, this is another thing I would like to like question because ooh, I, I could get it with my net. Where? Um. So I know for a fact that there we have made. Another uh, a sequel to um, a link to Oh, I didn't see you. That's a little bit gay. Uh, yeah, I know for a fact we made a sequel uh, to the link to the past, which is called uh, a link to the between the worlds or something like that. I. I have, I gotta be honest, I have never actually played it. But say it's supposed to be good. Like, really good. Um, but I haven't played it yet. Uh, so, I mean, if anyone has played it, then why don't you give me a shout and uh, see what it is? Because I might get it for my own 3DS and so. He just said you can't use it uh, physically to harm it and have to find a way to return the evil magic. But here's the thing, if you play the others like a Zelda and you play against Ganon, you know for a fact that you cannot. You're just supposed to reflect the, the magic beams on him. Get off me. Have a... There we go, there we go. I'm just picking up these jars. So. But yeah, I mean, even if we did a link uh, between the worlds and on 3DS, I will actually. This will be a cool idea, I think. Uh, because we have made the 3D, 3D world. Uh, oh, stop it. Um, we made 3D uh, versions uh, of Super Mario World, for instance. And it worked out really, really well. I will actually see... A f Ooh, stop it. Oh, I need I need health, really really bad. Can I like trick shout you? So <gasps> that was so so dumb. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm getting so nervous. I'm getting so, so nervous. And of course, the boss is just in front of me. I don't have anything. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Yeah, 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 yeah. And just, Link is just standing there. I mean, like, why don't you, like, do anything just to prevent... I mean, I can't move, but I mean, like, why don't Link just do anything... And he just, like, allows him to break the absolute last... Uh, the seal. Which is absolutely stupid. So, I mean... I mean, if Link really did uh, a lot, 
Then he just prevented. And oh, we, we don't know where he went. Uh, let's see. Did he went here? No. Did he went here? No. <gasps> A secret. No. No shit, man. Here's the thing. I don't know if I want to complete uh, do this here. I mean, I, I get one shot of this and then I will die. I, I mean, I can try to beat the boss, but then if I don't and I die, then I will continue the the boss in the next uh, part because uh, I will spare you with if I'm only going to continue and I have three hearts, I'm gonna spare you. With that. So if I die. I just gonna put it in the next part. So we 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 give it a shot and see what, how it goes. He 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 isn't really too too borderline difficult, but I mean every time I said that I had to eat shit. So I mean we we, we give it a shot and see if we manage to beat him. What you do basically, you just reflect the, the shots back. The, these uh, shots and not the other ones. And when he moves up there, he's gonna shoot his disgusting laser. So always get up here at this part here, because then he can't hit you. He shouldn't hit you if you are there. So yeah, he isn't too difficult, but... Uh, yeah, we actually managed to beat him. I'm I'm very happy that I'm got focused up and I actually could do it. Uh, so he, like a like a pussy he is. He's just uh, getting away. Look at Link. He just farts around like. Uh, so like a pussy he is. He just vanish. And I, I, again, like I love this here thing. I'm communicating to you across the void through telepathy. Again, like an excuse just to inform us what to do next. I, I just love it. Um. So, so this is where this is the part where if you in played Ocarina of Time, this is the moment where you're supposed to be in the chamber of the sages. Uh, and that you get this dude, uh, Raru, or I, th I think it's his name. I will call him Rar. Rar. Um, in, in a, anyway, Rar basically say explain the whole backstory that you were too young to be the hero of time, and we sealed you for seven years, and you had to find uh, those other sages and awake them to add their power to your might. So this is the, basically the part, and. Pretty much the same here, seven maidens will I get them sent to the dark world as my of the blood line. The only difference here is we say seven, and you probably think, well, there isn't really seven stages in Ocarina of Time. Fun fact, yes it is. There is seven uh, maidens or seven stages in Ocarina of Time. However, uh, Roar is basically giving you free medallion and you don't really have to do the temple of lights that he calls temple of time um, and then Zelda is the seven maid uh, so instead of giving her own dungeon um, he basically wants you to save her in Ganon's castle so in next part we are going to do Make we're gonna go straight ahead to the, the Palace of Darkness, like this Sahasharala uh, says, and we will save Princess Zelda. Uh, excuse me, Princess Zelda, uh, first uh, maiden, um, and get the first crystal uh, in order to break uh, the final barrier uh, to Ganon's tower. Uh, so. That's what we're gonna do next part, so I see you at that part, and thank you very much for watching.